Welcome to the ThoughtSpot Community Tutorial. In this video, we'll guide you on how to navigate the online ThoughtSpot community so you can make the most out of your experience. Let's get started. The ThoughtSpot community is organized into five main areas. Discuss, engage, explore, learn, and support. You can access these areas using the navigation menu located at the top of the page. If you're logged in as a ThoughtSpot partner, you can also access the partner portal from the nav. Finding the right information you're looking for is easy with our PowerFirst search experience. Regardless of where the information resides, you can now access results across product discussions, knowledge base articles, support cases, training courses, and product documentation with just one search. You can even filter the results based on the type of information you're looking for. Need help? Ask a question to our community of experts right from the home page. Be sure to provide enough information to help our community understand your issue and assist with troubleshooting. You can format your question by adding rich text or attaching relevant files. When others in our community help answer your question, you can thank them by marking a reply as the best answer. This indicates to others that the question has been solved and that others can benefit from this response if they encounter a similar issue. For experienced members seeking forums, there are multiple ways to navigate there. You can scroll down from the homepage to view filter posts such as latest questions, unanswered questions, or questions with no best answers to see where you can lend a helping hand. We have organized the forum into eight core topics. You can view questions and knowledge articles related to each topic when accessing the forums. Alternatively, if you're an expert in a specific subject, head to the Discuss menu to dive into discussions about your preferred topic. Before asking a question, we recommend searching through the forums first to see if there's a solved question or article that already addresses your issue. Are you interested in networking with other ThoughtSpot users? Head to the Engage tab to learn more about events happening in a city near you with our ThoughtSpot user group program or collaborate with peers virtually with our online discussion spaces. Under the Explore tab, you'll find relevant ThoughtSpot resources such as our GitHub, podcasts, blogs, videos, and more. Here you can also locate our product ideas area. The popularity of an idea helps our product team understand what's important to our user community and prioritizes these requests. Here you can submit, vote, comment, and gather support for features you're passionate about. Our product team leverages the number of votes to see how much support and usability this feature will have among our users. You'll discover a wealth of information by visiting the Learn tab. You can access our announcement section where you'll find our monthly newsletter. Additionally, you can explore free templates and guides, release notes, on-demand webinars, case studies, and other helpful resources. Let's take a moment to dive into our templates and guide resource. Accelerate your success with templates, guides, and examples curated by the teams at ThoughtSpot. These resources are designed to help you launch adoption at scale, covering customer life cycles, stages such as onboarding, use cases, implementation, launch and rollout, adoption and retention, and center of excellence. We've recently introduced 25 new articles, each with plug and play templates you can download to assist you in your journey. If you're a ThoughtSpot customer with access to support, you can locate your support case history here under the support tab and submit new tickets. That concludes our tutorial on navigating the ThoughtSpot community site. We hope that you found this video helpful in getting started. Happy exploring!